gonna prep the area for the fence. We're gonna leave like a foot and a half all the way around the beds for a path. And then we're gonna leave room for two more beds on this side, which we haven't built yet. Um, and we will. But, so I'm gonna start clearing for that. And then we'll start deciding where we're going to put fence posts. I'm not sure if you can kind of tell where I've cleared. So we want just enough all the way around the outside. And you can kind of see the line I've cleared here. And then that kind of resembles one bed and then there will be another one right here. And then across the top. And that goes down through the middle. And back. So we'll get these fence bits opened up and see how it goes. Okay. Okay, so this is all of our fencing material that we got from Critter Fences, and we're going to be setting that up as our perimeter fence for this project. So I'm going to start unboxing some stuff. I did watch a video about installing it earlier um, and the way this is instead of concreting ow, okay and instead of um, concreting in posts um, you hammer in sleeves what's happening here? <laughs> you hammer in sleeves and then the posts sit inside uh, <laughs> and then it's like a chain link where it runs the guide wires and then you attach the fencing. Um, we didn't get the gate through them sign. We'll just... Aha! <laughs> remember but there's definitely two different sizes and I think that's because these are the corner posts. <laughs> and then these are the sleeves I was talking about. like I'm missing these sleeves. These are the corner ones. And the, the corner posts are big. And then these ones are smaller. I don't know if I just didn't bring them up here. 
or what happened sorry hopefully you can hear me with the saw in the background i ordered them last year and at that time we had a different plan for the garden in mind um and it has since expanded and we had planned on using these two trees this one and that one as corner posts which i think is why i only have two corner posts so i might need to go on and order two more corner, corner posts and sleeves because i don't see them here and that's a little concerning so we're gonna figure it out i'm gonna go look for them we'll see what happens Okay, so now I'm inside at my computer because I have to figure out exactly what I ordered all those months ago. So I'm going to try and find the email here and see if I can see exactly what I ordered because I feel like we're missing stuff and I couldn't find it anywhere. So we're going to find out. Okay, so I figured it out. Um, past me and now me had two very different plans. I now vaguely remember that I just had a totally different plan. Um, and I had wrote it down in a file in my computer. And so I went on and I ordered the rest of the fence. So it all matched. Did I thought about scratching this fencing entirely, but we already have like 75% of what we need. Um, and so may as well just keep going with it. It's not the cheapest option. Um, and honestly, if I were to redo the whole plan now, it's not even the option I would choose, but, um, we've come this far and I just went ahead and to make it easier, I just got the gate that comes with that fencing, um, just to make it easier and it all will look the same and we only have to do it once. And then once it's up and it's done and it's supposed to last a really long time. So we're going to go with that, uh, which means the fence isn't getting done today. Um, so I ended up doing a bunch of other chores and we have to wait for it to come in, put the fence in. And in the meantime, um, we can't plant anything in the garden without fencing because the deer are here. I mean, they're everywhere. There are hoof prints in the beds from when I put the soil in yesterday. So it's not going to happen today, um, which is disappointing but that's okay. It'll give me time this week to finish those, that other trellis and maybe start beds in the evenings. Um, we have a lot of other projects to going, um, kind of creating a pantry slash root cellar in our downstairs, downstairs bedroom. Um, I'll give you guys a tour of everything in the house and, um, all of the above at some point uh so we'll have to rain check on the fence and when we get it we'll finish it up <laughs> 